back at it again here at the bubble where the Scarlet Knights wrapped up day three of spring practice. I'm Fatima Diallo and today I'm going one on one with defensive coordinator and linebackers coach Jay Neiman. Coach, how exciting is it to be able to go out there and coach plays and talk schemes and formations with your players? Well, that's a, the part of the job that you enjoy the most. I really love being around the players and the staff's a lot of fun to work with. So it's good to get out on the field and uh, start making progress towards the end result, which is going winning football games next year. We're having fun. And what will be the defensive philosophy for this team this fall? Well, you know, we, we want to be a good fundamentally sound defense. Um, we have to go through these practices to see what the player's skill sets are, whether we're a good base team, whether we're a good blitzing team. I think a lot of those questions are unanswered at this point and probably won't be answered until we get deeper into practice. And does it present a unique challenge of being a defensive coordinator behind a head coach who's made his name on defense? Yeah, it's unique, but it's good because uh, all the answers I need are 10 steps down the hall. So it works out pretty well. It's been a really good transition. Uh, Coach Ash has been great to work with, as have the other defensive guys. So um, it, it's all going really well right now. And you seem to have one of the toughest jobs this fall. You have to find three new starting linebackers. What has the competition been looking like so far? Well, it's early, uh, but everybody's really getting pretty much equal reps. Um, you know, we got to see what, what they all can do when they have an opportunity to get out there. And I think until we can begin to see some separation from guy to guy and find out who's playing a little bit better than somebody else, we'll continue to rotate them in and keep it all pretty even. And as a defense as a whole, how do you feel like the players are adapting to what you've been teaching them? Well, they're doing well. I mean, what I kind of look for is when we transition from one day to the next are, are the mistakes from the previous day being cleaned up. And uh, I think that's been true uh, today, like any other day, when you put some more stuff in, you're going to have some mistakes and some corrections, and then you got to go out the next day and see if you've gotten those problems fixed. So up until now, they've done a really nice job of, of, of uh, making those changes from one day to the next and showing that improvement that we're looking for. All right, thank you so much for joining me, Coach. Stay tuned right here on Our Vision for continued coverage on Rutgers football throughout the spring. Reporting from the bubble, he's your defensive coordinator and linebackers coach, Jay Neiman, and I'm Fatima Diallo.